touring the nest, I had my favorite because we didn't just tour the nest, we toured a couple other trailers as well. And I think you'll be surprised at which one is my favorite. So let's take a look around the Airstream showroom. It's, a, it's three inches taller, fatter tires. Okay. It comes standard with the rock guards okay. and the window guards. Oh, nice. This is hinged so that you can clean behind it. See your hand right here? Let's see, these are acorns, but this, it's just extra UV protection for, oh, okay. for your windows. So you don't need to take them off. You don't want to take them off because okay. the windows, the front windows on these don't open, but they zip. See, you see how they zip up to close? Oh, yeah. It's more... See, now this green door works. <laughs> it's more for like surfers and people that are going rock, rock climbing, mountain climbing, really outdoorsy people. Yeah, because you've got the back door. Yeah. So you slide your kayak and your paddle boards and your surfboards in yeah. here. Honestly, this one is just way too small. It does turn into, it converts into a dinette, but to deal with this every single day would be like a, Oh a real yeah, thing. I see what you mean. So these can come up. Where do these, these, where do they fall? They come up, these ones? Well, see, these become your backrest. Okay, and where do these go? These fold underneath the cushion. Okay, oh. and then you put your cushion on top. Okay. Okay. Then you have another set of legs, and all you do is pop in the taller leg, and you've got a uh, you've got a table. Okay, so that goes like that, but you have to do that every day. So that means it's it's super easy when you get rid of the cushions when you're not fighting the cushion. But then, where do you put the comforter and the pillows? There's not a whole lot of storage. It's less than the nest. Is the yeah. price up really? over there on the corner? Forty-three. Wow, for three thousand dollars more, you get that. Yeah. The nest is, I think, better. Yeah. yeah. So you have right, your, so, uh, your sink? sink there, but it, it flattens to make an extra surface. You have your two burner stove. This is, I could tell this is a good fridge. Hang on. Yeah, you have a bigger freezer than in the, um, than the, in the nest. nest. Uh, so down here, this is storage. storage. And, and then that's a tray for your shoes leaf. and dog tray water bowl. A stooge. <laughs> for shoes. Uh, here's storage again. A lot of storage. Yeah. Would this be... is storage here for your pistol oh, kind nice. of locks. Pistol and, storage, and, okay. And I put for that would be high on our list. Older people. No, we're, we're Canadian. <laughs> we don't believe. Are you guys. from Canada? Yeah. So it's yeah. This is this is like really an outdoorsy person kind of. This is trailer. what it looks like when. It, Oh yeah. So that's the same one. Right? It's a, this is identical. Only we, I leave this one. Yeah. With I, the table, the other one I leave as a bed. Cozy is definitely the word for it. Yeah. Small. But you know, when you think about it, it's a lot in a 16-foot package, especially True. with the rear door for your surfboard. Wow, nice. that's cool. I like that tire down there. Yep. And I mean, you have yeah. way more clearance on this guy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, this has got better clearance. I mean, this guy. But see, really this nice. only has a three-inch lift on it, so that's the difference. See now. Well, hang yeah. on. The, there's one downside to this Bambi, and you're gonna see it as soon as you walk in. Oh wait, look at this. Oh look how cool it is. It's so much storage. That's the underbed storage. That's under the bed. That's yeah. the stole this one's power cord. And you get you're getting the bigger awning. Bigger awning? Okay. But it's a manual awning. It's not That's you know, okay. Uh, we we deal with that. So here, uh, this is a this is a permanent dinette that you can convert into say uh, probably between a tween and a twin and a double bed. Mm -hmm. But you also you have the full width of the trailer to sleep in. It's true. You have storage up there, radio, and uh, what else? A satellite? Satellite ready. And uh, the speakers. Lots of storage up here. Oh, that's a great place yeah. to put the microwave. So it doesn't yeah, take any counter space. Unless like, um, you know, like a car guy, they drill a small hole and they can pull it out. So okay. double burner. But yeah, a lot of times we have to take off the whole panel. Monitor. I mean, yeah, even Water no, heater. No, it's only when you crack them. You, know, like you really Sink. have major damage. But that's why if they don't come with the rock guard, the rock guards are always a nice thing to put on there. 
because that's where you're going to get your dent. It's here. This doesn't come with one where the base can't I can't start. open this fridge. Oh, it's funny. That's it. That's just how you were doing it. I can't open it. But you got to put your camera down. Okay, now we use two hands. So this one is 49. Oh, there we go. Okay. So it's kind of like... This, it, I think, isn't this the same size? It's about the same size as the Casita. So and that, see how that latches? Yeah. So this one comes uh, solar ready as well. Solar pre-wire. Yes, okay, perfect. And, uh, okay, lots of storage up here. Awesome. That's a little hidden one. More USB. Check out this bathroom. I haven't seen it. Oh, it's a little small. I like I like the bathroom better in the nest. But you've got a window. Yeah. Yeah, I guess. There's a fan. Oh, it's pretty it's pretty tight in here. Is it? For not for me, but for Dorian it would be. For me it would probably be impossible. Yeah, it's a little bit tight. See, okay. every one of them has a little different nuances yeah. to it, you know? Yeah. Bambi technically is anything with a single axle. Oh, okay. So you have 16, 19, and So this one comes out Try and it. swivels around so that hmm. people sitting can there can watch it. Well, I have a Dodge Ram 1500. So 10,000. Why don't you just get the 22 foot sport and call it a day? It's only 4,500 pounds. Front bed, huge dinette, rear shower with where it's not a wet bath, where it's separate, you know, toilet and shower. That's a double axle, it, the 22? It's a single axle. single axle. When you go to the 23, it goes to the double, but then you jump in price from 57 to 73. So the 22 is 57? Yes. Oof. But you figure that's only about 10000 more than these. And, well, actually it's $7,000 more than this, and you get six more feet. Yeah. 22, yeah. Well, we it's like free because we fan. wear, like, remote things. Yeah. That's... Well, don't write off a 22 before. You know, I mean, we, we oh, what's this? <laughs> this is cool. Oh, yeah, it's a privacy curtain. So if... Guys, if you're here and you're sleeping here and you have guests sleeping over there, then you have this great privacy curtain, which is pretty fun. Yeah. Yeah. That's cool. So this one is the 22 Sport Single Axle and it's 57. And it's a Bambi also? Because it's, it's a single axle. axle. Huh, that is so cute. Wow. Wow, if we were going every time to the same place and we weren't hitting small, small parking spots, this would be the one. Oh yeah, look at the size of this, holy. Talk about being spoiled. This you could live in. Oh yeah, you could, oh my gosh, look at how big this dry shower is, this dry bath. This is the most popular model at the, at the most affordable price. This is the one that makes the most sense to most people. Most people. That's why we took it and we put an additional 20 grand on this one in extras. In case you want more stuff. Yeah. Okay. So people can customize it depending on their budget. Look at everything that's at. You could take a picture of that. You've yeah. got. But look, storage there. Look how big this is going to be when you convert it. And when you convert the bed, it's on a piston. So you loosen this and you just press down. That's pretty easy. But look, powder coated wheels, custom awning fabric. 200 watts of solar. Wow. A new inverter of the electric power jack, satellite antenna, front rock guards, upgraded to AGM batteries, rear bumper, custom dinette cushions, which are no big deal. Yeah. But. Yeah, I really like this. And I love the U shaped dinette. And see, the other thing is, 
this turns so oh yeah to let the other guy get in or out and it's removable in case you just want regular seating take it out yeah perfect and you got a u-shaped dinette yeah and the same windows right awning style thermal windows mm -hmm. same installation they're, oh, not moon roof. they're not airstream windows though that's where they've saved a little bit to okay. make it make up a difference but they're a very good window okay okay good <coughs> and, and the moon See, roof this is so this one is 57 it's their most popular seller it's 22 foot go take a look at the bathroom oh my god this is like <laughs> look at the shower go in the shower <coughs> can you believe that that's awesome and then you can customize it to have a bunch of extras. So depending on your budget, it could go up to like 75 or more, depending on what what else you want this with it. This one has a bunch of stuff on it. Double burner, lots of storage up here. Yeah, it's nice. I like it. Microwave. That's a big microwave too. It's not like the That's other one. one. That microwave does it all. What do they call Convection? that? Convection? Yeah. Whoa, look how deep those sinks are. Whoa. And what size, what size bed is this? That's it's a like little a, bigger bed. That's a, it's like yeah. a double to queen, maybe? Yeah. Okay. I'll be right back. Very cool. Uh, it's... This is like luxurious amount of space. This is like, I don't even know, we would lose each other <laughs> in this much space. <laughs> very, very cool. So 57,000 brand new. Oh. 75,000. No, 75,000 is with the upgrades that are listed on oh. here. But this is their biggest seller because for the size, it's the least expensive at 57,000. And it's a Bambi because it has a single axle. But this is their be one of their best sellers. 22. That's really a good price. Because of the value for the price. It's really a good price. Yeah, and this you can make into an extra bed. That comes down or it comes out. And this slides. But yeah, really cool. Camera. Back up. Oh, and it has, uh, this package has the rock guards and the electric jack and the dual six volt batteries. And of course this one has a solar panel, has 200 watts with a thousand watt inverter, he was saying. Nice windows. Outdoor shower. Now this one looks like yeah, that is the furnace. This is if we really like wanted to go to the same place every single year. So after thinking about all the different Airstreams, it's hard for us to choose a favorite. While the original Nest is has very low clearance, you can upgrade it to have higher clearance, much like the Base Camp, the Base Camp Sport actually. But I kind of like the interior design of the I do like the interior design of the nest but I really like the babies too and we took a look at the 22 foot sport and that seems to be the best seller and the reason why it's the best seller is that it gives you a lot of living space for a relatively low price and when we say low price we're comparing it to campers like the Bambi 16 and 19 so it's just a few thousand dollars more but you get so much extra space but when you're thinking about the nest the base camp and the Bambi 16 really what people are buying is the size the flexibility of having a small camper like that so although we would ideally kind of Frankenstein little bits and pieces from different Airstream trailers to put it and make our favorite trailer, 
we can't really say definitively that we had a favorite that we saw that day. It was a great experience though and we learned a lot about the Airstream trailers and uh, you know it's just a classic piece of Americana. You, you, I mean when you're buying an Airstream you're buying the like, name. You're buying the name, you're buying a lifestyle, you're buying into a kind of exclusive group. So we really, really liked it. I'm not sure that we would go ahead and buy any one of them again because we think that the best Airstream is one that we would kind of Frankenstein together from different models of Airstream. Like if we would go Airstream, ideal, I would buy something old refurbished like remodel and rent it out on Airbnb to give people that experience of you know a living. weekend living in the Airstream kind of thing yeah I agree with that but if I had something to invest to buy to live in it to explore like we're doing I don't think uh, I don't think I would have picked any any Airstream yeah, not for our current lifestyle, not for what we want it for. So we still think that we made the best decision. Even after seeing the Oliver, even after seeing the Escapes, even after seeing the Airstreams, we still feel like for where we are right now in our lives and our lifestyle, we still think that we made the, the best decision possible considering the Casita is pretty well everything we needed it to be for the pr for actually a lot less than what we wanted to spend initially yeah. and it's been a great learning experience and has enabled us to explore so many other options at the same time until we decide what our next trailer will be or what our next RV will be but we want to thank you for watching and we hope you liked our video if you liked it, don't forget to subscribe and click the notification button to make sure you're notified of all of our new videos. Peace out.